Hi everyone, I'm Mariam Motamedi, Product Marketing Manager for NVIDIA Riva, as well as Digital Humans. I'm so excited to be here with Adi, who's our Product Manager for NVIDIA Riva, uh, which is a collection of speech AI microservices built with NVIDIA NIM, and Nitin, who's our Senior Research Scientist working with the NVIDIA NEMO speech team. We're here to celebrate this great achievement of the newest Parakeet model, topping the Hugging Face ASR leaderboard, and we're just going to have a conversation about how this, this came about. So, Nitin, can you tell us more about the model and why it's so special? Yeah, sure, Mariam. Uh, thank you so much. Um, so, Parakeet V2, which is our latest version, is a highly robust English uh, speech-to-text model. Um, it's added to the more speech-to-text models from the Parakeet. Um, it's truly special uh, because the model is able to do high quality transcription with various background noises. So it's highly robust and also people can transcribe uh, at incredibly fast inference speeds. Excellent. So how did you train this model? Yeah, um, so with Parakeet V2, uh, we trained this model uh, in two stages. Uh, the first one is we started with the base model um, where you, we trained the base model on highly curated um, small small amount of hours of uh, human label data and large amounts of pseudo label data, uh, which we built uh, with the greenery data set. And this first stage actually helps us to build the highly robustness into the model. And during this initial phase, also we carefully balance uh, the data mix using the temperature tuning. Um, this is to ensure the model basically um, learns effectively from all these various corpora, uh, which we added in the base, model, base training. Um, the second stage, uh, which I think is the most important one to be on the top of the leaderboard is the quality data fine tuning, uh, which we actually fine tuned for almost like very small amount of time, um, like 30 minutes on four A100 GPUs. Um, and this gave uh, significantly more boost um, because we waited more on human transcript data in this fine tuning stage um, than the pseudo label data. Oh, okay. So this is how you got the low word error rate, which topped the ASR leaderboard, as well as a very high RTFX, which is the real time factor. Adi, can you tell us more about the RTFX metrics and why that's important? Yeah, sure. So it's tightly connected with cost. Um, for example, if you have a very long audio or video file, 3000 uh, minutes, then this model can just transcribe it in one minute which is an awesome number. And I think this combo of both low word error rate and high RTFX is really special. It can also be used to transcribe phone calls. So you can process 500 plus or 600 or more calls in parallel and transcribe them with that model. So truly amazing achievement. Really neat and amazing for you and the entire uh, Nemo speech team. Yes, truly. So Adi, what are you most excited about with this model? What, what use cases do you think can benefit other than the transcription of the phone calls that you just mentioned? Yeah, for those in the ASR industry, the, uh, I mean, it, it's known that if we have a noisy environment or if there's singing in the, as part of the stream or if it's a sport broadcast and there's a lot of very excited audience, uh, those are the hard uh, problems to transcribe in an accurate way. And this model excels in all of them. Um, so yeah, all those use cases can now be unlocked uh, and solved with a single model. Excellent. So when you think about productizing this model and putting it into the Riva NIM family where it's accessible on NVIDIA, on NVIDIA AI Enterprise, how do you go about that? Like what's your process to productize? Yeah, so first of all, it's, it's ready for production. So the model has a commercial license. So everybody who wants to use that same model, um, it's available in Hugging Face and you can use it in a production environment. Uh, in Riva, we're taking this exact same model uh, and we can add more data to it. Um, so lowering the word error rate even further, uh, we can add additional languages. So this model can be multilingual uh, or we can even further improve the RT effects, making it even more efficient uh, and scalable. We can do all three part of those, it's really part of the development process and productizing this model even further. That is wonderful. So if developers want to get started today, then Nitin, how do we get them? How do they get started? 
Yeah, um, actually we have put a lot of effort to make this model accessible and also everyone to use it um, as soon as the model gets releases. Um, so users um, and the developers can just get started right away uh, using the NVIDIA Nemo toolkit with just a couple of lines of code. The first one is basically to download a pre-trained model from Hugging Face, and the second one is you just transcribe an audio. So users can get um, started with the NVIDIA Nemo toolkit with as simple as two lines of code. Wonderful. So we want to hear the your comments. Everyone who's watching, please go to the model card on Hugging Face and add any comments. And we want to know what you're creating. So your your feedback is really important to us. Thank you both, Nitin and Adi. It was great speaking with you. And congratulations to you and the entire Nemo research team. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Miriam, for having us. Thank you.